Hello, I'm Bunnery. I'm Brad Noah. And, and this, this is, is IF, IF Extra. Extra. So, as you can see, I'm back this week. <laughs> Although I did do the video last week before mm. I went, but yeah, I wasn't here for the quiz last week. So here I am back for my craft weekend. Was it good? It was brilliant. Yeah, we had a nice time. Apart from the floods, it took us a while to get to the house because of the floods in Derbyshire. But eventually we got there by the evening. It's all good. <laughs> so yeah, I made some interesting things. I just thought you should have brought the insect house up and you could have shown it now. I should, shouldn't or I? Or you should post it on Twitter and mm -hmm. then everyone can have a look on Twitter yeah, or okay. Facebook or whatever. Yeah, I'll put it on Facebook, yeah. yeah. Social links at the end. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. So yeah, I made an insect house and then I made some fused glass. Mm -hmm. I made a panel for a lantern and I made three Christmas tree decorations. Cool. But we won't get those back until they be in the kiln. Mm. So we're waiting for those to arrive. Okay. Yeah, but they'll come soon. <laughs> but yes, it's nice, nice. Everything's normal again. Yeah, uh, yeah. I'm not just here on my own. It's, it's yep. always weird. I'll be here on the quiz tomorrow, don't worry. <laughs> um, so yeah, in the meantime, I, I hosted the quiz uh, myself. Well, I had I had Little Bunny and Little Ferret there. Uh, anyone who uh, who watched on Sunday will have noticed. They seem to be quite popular. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, yeah, it went um, went all right. But you know, it's not quite as much fun when you're not here. And apparently I waffled more. <laughs> I bet you did. Because there was no one to keep me in check. No, no one to tap you on the leg saying stop mm. it. <laughs> um, so uh, yeah, aside from that, we mm -hmm. had an interference and chill this week uh, that was with Ooh. Ferret because uh, she was uh, available. So uh, yeah, that was quite cool. She drew some uh, drew witch dog, which witch seemed dog. to be very popular. Um, okay. That game's just finished actually. I've just seen it in the in the gallery. Cool. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, if you miss any of these streams, you can always go and check out the replay at mixer.com/interference, uh, and they are all on there for about two weeks after their broadcast date. Mm -hmm. And then I'm very gradually uploading them all to YouTube. Although I'm kind of behind with that, so they're like six months out of date. But <laughs> we'll get there. Okay. We'll get there. <clears throat> Okay, right. I think if that's all the news for now, let's have a look who won this week's awards. Picture of the week this week goes to Shinkinoko for Rainbow Teepee in the middle of Antarctica. I just love the way the ice is floating on the sea and the beautiful sky and the colours of the teepee are gorgeous. That's wonderful. Well done, Shinkinoko. My favourite description this week was Angry Outer Layer of Sun at Dusk Looks Mischievous by Banty. Now, this was perfect interference. It was actually two people watching a sunset, but from the way they're sitting, their heads look a bit like eyes and their bodies look a bit like a mouth, and it really does look like a mischievous face. Fantastic interpretation. Nice work, Banty. Community Pick of the Week this week goes to Nat for Cat Under Tree Staring at City Lights. That's weird because this was like Pitch of the Week last week, but obviously so many of you liked it this week, it's now Community Pick. Well done, that's a double award, Nat. They were amazing. Awesome work there as always. Cool. Now we're going to have a look at what we were talking about last week in the forums. So last week, inspired by Bunnery's uh, craft weekend, I was asking, what's the last thing you made that you were really proud of? Ooh, interesting. Because, I mean, you know, a lot of the time um, we, we make, you know, we make things online, mm. but sometimes it's nice to make, things in real life. make something with your hands. Yeah, you tangible. Know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, so uh, Angela was saying um, that she wished we could post pictures on the forums and maybe mm. i should sort that out that would be day. good actually yeah. um because she's been trying to paint on canvas the last Ooh. one i did uh, she was super happy about um <gasps> it's a tropical ocean sunset a waterfall out of a porthole falling into celestial clouds really proud of myself because painting on canvas is hard yeah we used yes, to do true. that didn't we yeah <laughs> yeah we used to go to a little painting class like mm. once a month or something yeah and uh I wasn't very good at it. But, <laughs> I mean, it's um, the game I, mean I really enjoyed it. <laughs> yeah, it was good I wasn't very yeah, good. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but Renee said she made a fantastic layered chocolate cake. I mean, cake is always good. That is art, isn't it, really? Mm, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you can eat it. <laughs> mm. On the subject of things you can eat, uh, mm. Anvil, <laughs> Anvil said uh, a lamb muffin sandwich. Um, and okay. went into quite a lot of detail uh, about the ideal sandwich. So, yeah. Um, you should read that if you want to make one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you're looking for tips on how to make lamb sandwiches, uh, yeah, you know, check that out. Um, sorry, go on. Oh, yeah, poor... Um, 
door doodle. <laughs> the last thing I made, a lot of notes while studying for exams. Oh dear, we feel your pain. <laughs> the notes did contain occasional doodles. Well, that's good then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. True to your name. <laughs> well, sometimes you just need to let your mind just think about something else briefly yep. so things can sink in. So, exactly. Yeah, yeah, I support that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now we're going to find out what we're going to be talking about next week. What sport do you like to play? If you don't play any, what sport do you like to watch? I've never really been into playing sport. I prefer going to the gym, but I like watching snooker and darts, but maybe they're more games than sport. If you'd like to chime in with that, then just head over to the general discussion forum. It's the pin thread for the week, so you'll find it at the top of the thread list. Cool. Now don't forget, tomorrow night is quiz night with the two of us mm. hosting. <laughs> Back to normal. Yeah. So who won last week when I wasn't here? Well, uh, last week it was quite uh, quite sort of tight towards the end. Oh, like, you know, there was only a few points difference between wow. it all. Uh, mm -hmm. And we eventually finished with Phantom in first place on 229. Yeah. And then Jess in second place on 221. And one point behind, Crash Thatch in wow. third place on Crash 220. Crash was back then? Cool. Yeah, yeah. Nice. <laughs> um, but, they, you know, it had been really tight through the whole thing. So it all came down to the last couple cool. of questions. Did everyone like my um, time travel round? Yes. The the time travel round was very popular. Was it? Cool. Um, because this, this was the thing. You, I don't see any of this ahead of schedule. So <laughs> I had no idea what was coming up. Yeah. And the round was, was it just called time traveling? Mm -hmm. um, and so we were all assuming it was going to be, um, you know, time travel in films or mm -hmm. TV or something. But actually, we were the time travelers. <laughs> so we had like a description yeah, of an event. What was happening around us, And yeah. you had to work out what the event was. Yeah. yeah. Um, so cool. it was really cool. Yeah, it's very popular. Good, good. We like stuff like that. Good. <laughs> okay, if you want to find out what's in this week's quiz, you better tune in tomorrow. <laughs> are you going to give us a little uh, sneak preview? Are you going to tell us what who the featured artists well, are? Well, okay, yeah. I've chosen five different artists with awesome drawings to build my rounds around. <laughs> and they are Angela Wan, C. Drog, Nat, Taylor Smiley, and Wildly Wrong. So that should be interesting. If you've not seen the quiz before, basically each round is based on a drawing from this week's uh, interference games. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if we have a drawing of a seagull, might have a round on seabirds. Did you like the round on seabirds? Um, <laughs> well, I mean, I noticed there are a few things kind of dropped into this, um, into this quiz because there was shrews as well. <laughs> yeah. After you told me there would be no shrews. Um, you, it's you, all fun. You need, to, you need to watch these things to start sort of understanding yeah there's always jokes. kind of in jokes starting to happen with this mm -hmm. uh, like i didn't know what a shrew was yeah anyway and we have lots of catchphrases too don't we i digress yeah, um so that's one of them <laughs> if you um well i'll come to that in a moment um if you if you haven't tried this it's basically a, a live quiz show it's a bit like watching a tv quiz show apart from instead of shouting at the screen when you know the answer you can actually tell us what you think the answer is yeah. um, press the button we give you 10 points if you're right and a bonus point if you're the fastest correct answer. So you can play along against the rest of the audience and see who knows the most. Cool. It is um, good fun, isn't it? We even have a new custom sticker for the channel uh, for you to play with um, this Ooh. week that we uh, we test out on Interference and Chill. Something that may be relevant. Okay, yes. that'll be something to look forward to. <laughs> okay, that's all the news for this week. So it just goes to say... Yeah, if you're not already taking part in the game, then get involved at playinterference.com. You can also follow us on Twitter at PlayIFX or on Facebook at Play Interference. We've also now got a Patreon page at patreon.com slash interference if you want to give us a bit of monthly support for the ongoing maintenance of the game, running the quiz, looking after cats and all these other bits and pieces. We do a really appreciate your support we do okay we'll see you this time next week bye have, for now have a great week we'll see you next saturday bye, bye. Mm -hmm.